and COVID, what you learn in that time, how do you come back? So. Um, being sidelined was definitely <laughs> tough, like going through the injury and all that, but I think when Coach G got here and Coach Walt really helped me out because I was watching film every day and making sure I got better in some way, in some form, even though I wasn't exactly on the field. What exactly was the injury you were dealing with? Um, a labor. Okay. Yeah. What did you see from Jalen? Obviously, you were, in this point, like you were in this spot last year. What did you see from him in his first uh, Jalen is, he's special, man. Um, he's a great player. He's got a lot of potential, and I know he's going to keep building on that potential. So. Um, I'm excited to see what we get out of him. Jim Knoll said that for you, it's confidence and reps are the most important things. Where are you more confident right now as a sophomore? Um, like I said earlier, just playing a lot faster. I feel like I'm more calm out there. I feel like the moment isn't too big. I feel like um, getting bigger throughout the throughout the year and when I was hurt um, definitely helped me. Caleb's mental capacity for this game is kind of legendary. We hear stories about all the time. Mm -hmm. What have you just picked up with him uh, being around him that you know, kind of I think the great thing about Caleb is he's such he's such like a, a likable person, a likable teammate, a great teammate. Um, he help he'll help you. He'll help any of the teammates. Um, he's definitely he definitely knows what he's doing. He's a great player. Um, and for me, he just pushes me to be better every day. Malik, with, with your room being so stacked as it is, I mean, you guys are just piled, right? Do you think that there could be the opportunity, though, for you guys to all see quite a bit of playing time throughout the season and not just, you know, towards the end of games, mop-up duty kind of playing time, but, like, some real meaningful reps? I think that our room definitely has a lot of great players, but as far as playing time, like, that's a question for Coach Knowles. Well, I mean, have you guys kind of been prepping for that, though, throughout the fall camp, maybe switching in and out and, and, and really kind of seeing a lot of one-two action? Um, we're definitely, we're all getting, like, reps at, at each spot. So, like, it's not just a Justin and Bandit anymore. It's not just, it's not just you're here, you're there. We're all playing different positions. We're all learning different techniques. So it's making each one of us more versatile. So sure. you've been playing some Bandit, too? Yes, sir. Okay. How comfortable do you feel at that strong safety spot? <laughs> I feel comfortable in any safety spot. So, it's, it, I mean, the more reps you take, the, the easier it is. And I played both safety spots last year, so it's not really that big of a transition. What are the differences between the two spots that you have to get used to? Um, honestly, this year they made it so they're kind of, they're, I mean, they're both, they're both, you have to do each thing in both spots. So, like, you have to come down and make tackles at Bandit. You have to come down and make tackles at Adjuster. Um, Obviously, it's boundary and field, so the, the spacing's a little different, but, I mean, you have to do everything at both safeties. Malik, what's different, what's different this camp compared to last camp for you personally? For me personally, I feel like I have, I developed a better routine. I feel like I'm more mature in um, what I'm doing, and I feel like just go out there and play and have fun. I think that's the biggest thing for me. Don't, don't get too caught up on the last play. What have you added or what have you improved to your routine? Um, I think just getting here earlier and at times last year, you know, when it's hard to maintain that routine throughout throughout the whole camp or throughout the whole the whole um, year. But this year it's, it's easier to maintain that because I know what to expect. I know the requirements of me and I know that the team is kind of on me. Were there guys in last year's room that influenced you to show up a little bit early? Um, yeah, for sure. I mean, everyone, everyone is required. BIA, our standard is so high that we challenge everyone. It doesn't matter if, if you're going to play this year. It doesn't matter if you're going to play two years from now. It doesn't matter if you're, if you're a true freshman. You're going to come in early and you're going to put in the work just like everybody else because it's not just the, the starters that are held to the standard. It's everybody. It seems like Jalen McLean's on kind of a similar trajectory as you were last year where he's pushing for playing time right away. Yeah. What have you seen from Jalen that's impressed you? Um, he's all over the field, man. I mean, he, he, runs to, he runs to the ball every play. He hits hard. You know, he's making plays on the ball. So, I mean, he has, like I said before, he has a lot of potential, and I'm excited to see what he does this year. Like you talked about getting bigger. It felt like you gained, what, like 20 pounds last offseason. Yeah. Were you able to keep that weight on, and what does it look like to gain even more weight? Um, so... I mean, through the season, it kind of fluctuated, but right now I've gained even more weight, so I'm at like 195 now, and the plan is to get to 200, but it definitely builds confidence when you got to go down there and fill, fill a gap. 
Yeah, I imagine even like playing close to the ball, you said, you know, playing some. Exactly, yeah, yeah. yeah. You, you were obviously on West the wrong question. end of a play in that Michigan game last year. Just what did you learn from that? I think that um, coach preaches competitive excellence, and that means putting yourself in position to make the play, and that means practicing harder. That means that means taking each rep like it's that big moment in the game, and um, that's definitely what I've tried to do this year.